G'day guys, welcome back, Max here. Uh, today, I thought it'd be fun to watch the dojo fight scene from Fist of Legend starring Jet Li. In the last video, we watched the Bruce Lee dojo fight from Fist of Fury, and for those of you guys who don't know, Fist of Legend is a remake of that movie starring Jet Li rather than Bruce Lee. Uh, you guys have been requesting Jet Li a lot lately in the comments, so I thought it would be really fun to do both of these scenes one after the other and see what we think. Uh, really excited for this. You guys know I'm a big Jet Li fan. I'm really glad you guys have been enjoying him as well. Uh, if there are any other scenes of his or any ones that you would like me to look at, make sure to leave a comment down below and then subscribe so that when I do get around to doing the video, uh, you guys are going to be kept up to date with it. So that being said, uh, i got Jet Li, headphones, you guys, uh, dojo fight scene, Fist of Legend starring Jet Li. Here we go. One, two, three. Oh. Chudan Ski, Jordan Uke, Gaydan Bra. I'm getting like major flashbacks from the wooden floor and the uh, Shinai in the instructor's hand. My old instructor used to have one of those he hit us with to get us deeper down into our stances as well. <laughs> These Wushu guys, man, they love taking on multiple fighters. Wow. I am Chen Zan. Where is Akutagawa? <laughs> Just. Total deadpan, no emotion at all. I'm not going anywhere till Akutagawa comes. That's when you know that's when you gotta be scared when someone comes in and they just no emotion. That was beautiful. Just grabs him by the head and throws him to the floor. Doesn't even bat an eyelid. 30 guys doesn't bat an eyelid. Beautiful back fist, teep, teep, shot to the body grab. <laughs> oh, that was sick. <laughs> Got to watch out for them sweeping the leg while you're in the air. Oh, that was beautifully done, just marching through the guys. <laughs> he loves doing that kick and making a slide. Oh, there was a scene just like that in, uh, in the Bruce Lee one as well, where he does like seven, eight kicks in a row. No less impressive. Beautiful. That guy can do the splits, that's nice. Definitely much more fast paced than the Bruce Lee one, for sure. Everything's happening a lot quicker. And there's no big rear elbows to the body like uh, like Bruce Lee used to love too. So far they're pretty faithful to like the pacing of it. Oh, that was sick. I love the spinning kick, big deep to the thigh. <laughs> it's not quite the double back fist from Bruce Lee, but the double punch to the chest is a bit of a Donnie Yen special too. That was a fantastic takedown. In uh, the original one, Bruce Lee went and smashed everybody's shins with a pair of nunchucks. So that like kick to the shin and the guy sitting on the ground rubbing it is a, I'm imagining a bit of a throwback to that, which is kind of a cool little homage uh, to the original one. And that like step through uh, throw like over the leg, the sweep was amazing. Oh. <laughs> Just kicks him right out of the air. The choreography is incredible. Like these stunt uh, stunt men are amazing. <laughs> I was wondering what stopped him in his tracks. Kick. You know what? I never thought to do that when I was younger. Just kick through the shinai. Oh, straight up power move. Could have thrown the kick, but doesn't. All right, we fought the bodyguards. Now it's time for the big boss. We shall challenge each other openly and fairly. <laughs> it's never fair in these movies, if one though. One of us dies. There will be no revenge. <laughs> you know what they say about revenge? If you go out seeking revenge, dig two graves. Master fought you with a hua fist. <laughs> it would be his wish for me to do the same. Very nice, very nice stance. It's a Kokutsudach reverse back stance. One of my favorites, but very, very hard to fight from. Beautiful kick dexterity to kick like that and then pull the leg back without, <laughs> without hitting anything is really, really difficult. Yeah, that broke a few bones in the foot for sure. That's gonna, that's gonna sting. Oh. 
<laughs> straight up knife hand, straight. I wonder if that's ever worked in the history of fighting. I love the way he just toys with people in these fights. He's doing a Mike Tyson, he's gonna rip his ear off. Not gonna use his teeth though. <laughs> to kick his way up into a handstand though, I don't know if they did that with wires or what, but that was impressive. I can't go from lying down to a handstand. Hey, you stay out of it, students. Beautiful inside low kicks. Karate guys have a hard time dealing with those. If he had been healthy. Whoop. The three stooges go for the eyes. The Aikido wrist lock throw to finish. <laughs> I guess him and his Chinese shoes are leaving now. <gasps> the guy's lucky. You guys lucky you didn't kill him. All right, guys, so compared to the first one, obviously the choreography is a little bit more modern. It's a little bit faster. Uh, they have cameras that can keep up with things a little bit better so they can move faster. They've got a bit better technology with the wires and things. Um, and also just 20 more years of experience choreographing fights and learning how it works on screen. You got to remember though, that that's, that movie is 30 years old in itself. So the Bruce Lee one is 50 years old almost. Um, and it holds up incredibly well, but... I think I have to pick the remake. Just a big Jet Li fan, and just the speed and the pace of it is just a little bit, a little more modern, a little bit faster. The sound effects, you know, match up a little bit better and things like that. So I think out of the two, that one's my favorite. But let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you prefer the original. You know, the original's always the best. Um, so let me know if you guys prefer the original or you prefer the Jet Li version down below. Uh, and as always, you know, subscribe, keep up with the videos that we're gonna be putting out. Uh, thank you all again so much for coming, hanging out with me. I look forward to seeing you all in the next one. Stay awesome. Have a great night. Bye.